This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Mark Thomas with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. The College World Series is here. It's a different format this year with games getting underway. Friday as opposed to Saturday, Oklahoma opens things up with Texas A&M at 1. Then Texas takes on Notre Dame later in the day. Saturday, Arkansas faces Stanford in the afternoon. Then Ole Miss meets Auburn at 6. All first round games will be shown on ESPN, except for Saturday nights. That'll be on ESPN 2. Thursday, Iowa Governor Kim Reynolds issued a disaster declaration in Pottawatomie County and for others due to the severe weather. That move allows state resources to be used to respond to and recover from the effects. And I'm 3 News Now meteorologist Chris Swaim. Isolated storms expected tonight. That is to say they're not for everyone. But where they do set up, heavy rain, large hail, and some damaging wind is all possible. Have a way to get alerts through the overnight hours. We'll land at 66 degrees and then temperatures warm back up quick to 91 by Friday afternoon under mainly sunny skies. Our focus shifts from the storms to the sweltering temperatures for the weekend and next week. 93 Saturday, 97 on Father's Day, Juneteenth. Breezy conditions, winds out of the south pumping in hot and humid air. We're talking about the century mark for Monday. If we can hit 100, it'll be the second time this year. Uncommon to do it multiple times in a year. 100 is an elusive mark for us. Here we are. 90 on Wednesday, 95 on Thursday. Scattered storms midweek next week. Keep a close eye on everything as we head into the weekend.